Hey, good morning. It's Ray here at Nan Ray Farms. It's Friday. Fantastic Friday. I pray your week's been great. This week we've been reviewing that story of those teenage girls that let those lambs out of the gate and those little lessons we've been able to pull from that. And You know, the truth is we all make mistakes. Just like those girls when they opened the gate and those little lambs squirted out, we all make mistakes. But we amplify our mistakes by trying to chase after them, trying to slow them down, trying to catch them on our own, trying to figure things out. How can I fix the problem? And the truth is, it's not up to us. The devil will have us chasing our tails for the rest of our lives if he can at all possible accomplish that goal. And the way he accomplishes that goal is by telling us lies. Like, this is all your fault. You've got to fix it. There's nothing you can do but keep chasing. And then the greatest lie of them all, you'll never catch Jesus. You'll never be like Jesus. You'll never be who he meant for you to be. And so we keep chasing and chasing and chasing. I know I do until we're completely worn out and there's nothing left within us and we fall down exhausted from the chase. But Jesus has told us through his word, there is no need to chase me for I am with you always, even until the end of the world. And if you, O lamb, you are the one who squirts out of the gate. I will seek you and I will find you because I'm going to seek you with all my heart. What a beautiful picture for us. We must expose these lies of the enemy so that we can live in the foundation and truth of what God has given us. And that is that today you can enjoy the shepherd. You can enjoy a relationship with Jesus. All you must do is be still. Allow him to pour his love out upon you. There's no need for you to keep chasing and pursuing the carrot on the end of the stick today. Rest in the fact, in the truth, that the work has been accomplished. Jesus said it is finished. He committed his hands into the Father's Spirit, and so today, you too can cry out, Father, Shepherd, into your hands I commit my spirit. Now go enjoy the Shepherd. I'll see you soon.